welcome to Bite Size Piano. In this video I'm going to teach you how to play A Thousand Miles by Vanessa Carlton. So we're going to look at the entire song today and we're just going to be looking at the piano accompaniment part, not the vocal melody line. So on screen now are all the sections that we're going to go over in the video. So the ones that are highlighted in orange are going to be the ones that we're going to go through and then the ones in grey are just repeats of those other sections. So the song is in the key of B major. So on the screen now are all the notes of the scale of B major. And these are the notes um, from the melody and what the chords are made from. So we're gonna have a look at the intro first and then this will repeat in numerous different times throughout the song. So here is middle C for reference. So I'm gonna be starting with my thumb on the B above middle C. So this is going to be a very widespread hand position. So the right hand is first going to go B, 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 A sharp, B, A sharp, F sharp, and then D sharp, C sharp, B. So that's the first bit. Then the next bit goes B, 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 A sharp, B, A sharp, F sharp, B, F sharp, B, F sharp, B, D sharp, E, D sharp, C sharp. So I'm just going to join together what we've done so far. And it does that first bit again. And then you're going to play these two again. So the last bit that rounds off the intro goes D sharp, C sharp, B again. F sharp. And then you're going to play B and C sharp together. So the left hand is going to be playing the E above middle C, E, F sharp, D sharp, E, and then it does that again, E, F sharp, D sharp, E. And that's all the left hand is doing really in that one, so I'm going to very slowly put that together for you. So now we're on to the verse. So all the verses um, are played in this way. I'm gonna move my camera down a little bit lower. So here is middle C again. So on that B again, so the right hand is just gonna go B, A sharp, and then F sharp, B. And does that again. And it'll be into the... Do that again. B, A sharp, F sharp, A, E. B, A sharp, F sharp, E. And then that bit again. So the left hand is going to play E and B, and then F sharp and C sharp, and then D sharp and B. And then E and B again. And it does that again. And then we have with the, the same notes as the intro, um, but if you can play in octaves, playing octaves. So I'm going to 
put slowly the entire verse together and again this is the same for the second verse and also the third verse because I need you. That is the pre-chorus, so let's have a look at this. So the left hand is playing E three times, so E, 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 F sharp, D sharp. So the same three notes again. And then the right hand, you're going to play, first of all, E, F sharp and B. Um, I would play it with you one, two, three if you can. So we're going to go one, two, three, and then if you slide your hand up the piano, you're going to add the D sharp in there as well with that chord. That's quite strenuous on the hand. But again, this is what's going on in the song. So one, two, three, one, two, three, and then you're going to play C sharp. F sharp, C sharp. So you're kind of rotating on this F sharp. And if I play that with the left hand. And then we're going to come down to an E in the left hand, and then a B and F sharp in the right hand and then to F sharp and A sharp. So the bit where she's going, and now I wonder. So that's the pre-chorus done. And again, that is the same for all of the other pre-choruses as well. So the next is the chorus. So all the choruses are the same. So in the chorus, the right hand's gonna play A sharp, B, F sharp. That's all. whole way through until the bit where she's singing if I could just see you all the way up until there so 12 times and then the left hand is just playing the again so I'm gonna play the chorus all the way through and then I'll show you the little bit at the end going to come up and play G sharp, A sharp, F sharp, and the right hand with that, F sharp and B, and then F sharp and C, and then F sharp and A. If I can just hold you. And then tonight, and she's doing the an octave higher again, but with octaves in the left hand, and she goes through that twice. So now I'm going to play the whole of the chorus with the post-chorus bit added on at the end as well. Thank you. 
next section we're going to have a look at is actually the second post chorus which is ever so slightly different than the first one so if i just play it slowly And then a little bit at the end is the... Which is like the beginning. And then we have this extra C sharp, D sharp, C sharp, B. Then into the I, I, the bridge section. So left hand is doing the exact same thing. So I'm just going to play the second post chorus now. difference is that she's sort of holding on that D sharp so like that so the bridge then the right hand is just going to be playing um, an inversion of F sharp major so if you can stretch it C sharp F sharp A sharp and C sharp but miss out the bottom C sharp if you can't so sort of playing it like this. And that's all that the right hand is doing. And the left hand is gonna is coming is like ascending. So it's going G sharps, A sharps, B's, C sharps, back to and it repeats that again. Back into the making my way downtown, walking fast, faces pass, I'm homebound. So all the other sections after the bridge we have already covered. So the last chorus where it's stripped back a little bit um, is exactly the same except that maybe you just wouldn't play octaves in the left hand. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna play the how it how it finishes. So if I'm playing the very last chorus, which is just like the other choruses and then into the outro, which is basically the same as the intro as well. So that concludes the tutorial. In all the different sections you'll need to play the song all the way through. So again, this is just the piano accompaniment part. So I hope that you've enjoyed it and that it's been useful. Please give this video a thumbs up if you have. If you're new here, please consider subscribing to Bite Size Piano for many more piano tutorials like this one and on all different kinds of topics and genres and songs. So go and check out um, my many more videos. If you can't find what you're looking for there, um, if you go to the comment section of this tutorial, go follow the link that I've posted there and there you can submit a piano tutorial request. So all requests um, are noted and considered. So yours could be coming up soon. So I hope to see you in future videos. Bye-bye.